Hey friends, I've done my steps and my editing for today. And we're gonna take you out. I think Jason's out here. He is. So we can finally tell you and show you. So I met our neighbor. Oh, that they have like two or three Teslas? No. Right? Well, maybe two, but he, he backed out and he drove up and he's like, is this yours? I'm like, yes, oh, welcome, welcome. And, I was like, and so we started chatting and everything. It's like, oh, this is the best. What kind you get? And everything. Yeah. He's like, oh, that's the best. Uh, and then he's like, okay, well, I, I'm doing some stuff. I'll, I'll come back. We'll talk. <laughs> he's joined the club. Oh, that makes a man happy. What also makes a man happy is cleaning his car. Very beautiful car. Do you have some old rags I can clean your car with? So you can't use the brand new ones? That's why he said this. He can't use the brand new ones he just got at Costco because the old ones we have that are exactly like this are not good enough for his car. I said it just to I'll clean your car after this. Right. <laughs> Douche. Douche with a Tesla. Have you already washed it and now you're doing the tires? The t they're brand new tires. You've literally gone to work in for like four days. I know, but I've never used this before. And I'm always curious what it does. It cleans brand new tires. Well, it makes Whoop it shiny do. or something. Okay. What needs to happen is he needs to take his wife for a ride in the car I've never even driven. I know, I realize you haven't really been in the car, have you? No. I, I didn't even get to drive in it because I had to drive the other car home. Well, we should go for a drive. We should go for a drive. Oh, there's a random dog. Hey, wait, wait. Say that again. Well, I, I asked if take, I could drive it. I got to take you for a drive because it's like a manly thing to impresses woman with his car. I just told him he missed the spot, but you really did. Right there. <laughs> no, right there, I can see it right there. You can oh, put oh, your oh. shadow on it and you can see it right there. Okay, I'll get a little round. You just smudged it. I did. All right, I feel like I need to have cool shades on in order to be in the cool car. You do. I do. You must. So he's trying to get it so that my phone where did I put my phone? Can be one of the users. So that when I walk up to it, it'll turn on. Some of the things Jason has gotten for the car are these little car, what are those, cup holders? Cup holders. Like attachments so that you can take this out and clean it, right? Yeah, just makes it. Keeps it all snug. Now I need to hook my car to his. So he was just showing me how you can go up to speed. Got up to like 75 on a 40 mile an hour road and literally slowed down to 45 the second we saw a cop down the other direction. We were so lucky you weren't going almost 80 when well, he saw you. What did you say you. about the acceleration? It hurts your head. <laughs> <laughs> like, it gets you dizzy. Like, if you were to stay at that speed, maybe you could like acclimate to it or whatever, but he immediately then had to slow down because he shouldn't have been going that speed. So we are going to go and get our vaccine boosters today. If it's going to mess me up, I can No, go she work. said it's not. She said it's not. All right. So our friend, the pharmacist who has set up all these clinics for the past, what, year and a half, she's just doing a small one today. I could only get like six people to go and get their boosters today. I think people were kind of over it <laughs> and <laughs> whatever, but if I can prevent just like, and I'm getting the flu shot too. If they said that the flu shot is gonna help out a lot this year just because, you know, we've kind of been immune to getting sick for so long because we've stayed away from people. And so these new strains of flu can really hit people harder. So we're gonna try that. He's probably not actually gonna let me drive this yet. He's laughing at not answering because <laughs> that's correct. And if he answers, then he'll lie. That's how, that's how, he'd be a great politician. Lies through his teeth. Maybe someday. Let's go. Are people coming in again? Good morning. But they can't. There's no way. <laughs> that hurt, baby. Did that hurt? Yes. I don't like it. <laughs> Next up is Cafe Rio. Because I have a free salad. Or I have rewards. Let me just make sure I have it on my phone. Pretty sure I have 10 to 15 dollars in rewards on my phone. So I have 10 dollars in credit and I'm like so close to another 10 dollars. So this purchase 
beyond the $10 should get me the, that extra 12 points. He's having a really hard time right now. He's having a hard time letting me get into this side of the car. You gonna be okay, babe? I'll try, just don't bang the rims. Okay, because I bang the rims in my car every day. Well, your car has bigger tires. I do know how to drive. Okay. So, it feels good to drive it? Yeah, it feels good for my husband to let me wear the pants every once in a while. <laughs> You do look cute driving it. I do. I did say that when we did the one test drive. I know. I was like, you look cute in it. I know, so you should let me drive it more often. Silence. <laughs> He's silent when he won't answer because if he does, he'll be lying. <laughs> Not lying. I just, I would like to drive it mostly. <laughs> I know. I know. Anyways, you look good it's doing it. It's our car, right? It is our car. You're right. Yeah. Okay. I've decided what? I didn't want Abby to drive this car because I need her to learn how to use a regular car first. Yeah, yeah, she needs to get used to that first. But I think both girls need to drive this car with this man in that seat and they'll be like, yeah, no, I'm driving with mom now. <laughs> we can just drive a different car. <laughs> He's like gotten mad at me like 10 times. I haven't gotten mad. I just told I you. I did not hit the curb. You did with the tire. I did not. Did, well, let's get out and check. I bet there's a rub bark on the tire. On the tire? You're not gonna like seriously. The tire? I know you were so close. I'm like, oh, you're close, and then you got you it got the tire. It didn't hit. Luckily, you got the tire, not the rim. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Go eat my salad and ignore you. Okay. Pretend like you didn't come home from work. Sounds like Take a plan. me on a nice little date that ended up in like this. <laughs> Fast forward through a very wonderful Friday afternoon nap, and then being lazy on the couch, yeah, and yeah. this sure. guy. I uh, went to help set up for the haunted forest at our friend's house, right? Yeah. And I have no more coke left and I'm trying to be really good. Um, but every once in a while I do like to have one. And so ran to Target and got some. And this little uh, Squishmallow back here Squishmallow. <laughs> um, came along for the ride and got herself a little snack and Chelsea a snack and Abby a snack. And um, and now we're here at McDonald's. Not for what you think though. Although I think he's gonna get a little snack a himself. Little but he's hoping, why don't you go through the drive through first? Are you just gonna wait and see if it works? Uh, might as well. Um, he's gonna do an update to our software in the Tesla. But our current Wi-Fi at home. Sucks. Sucks. And we are waiting another week and a half for an appointment with, who's our company again? whatever our internet company is. Direct TV. Direct TV or whatever, to get a new router or something in order for us to buy a big fancy super duper internet system. But, no, just upgrade our Wi-Fi so that it's, right. it's supposed to be faster. Right, but he has to have Wi-Fi in the garage in order to do these software updates on the car and to have Wi-Fi in the car on the road, but, um, it doesn't work at home. So we're currently parked in front of McDonald's now because the Wi-Fi, I connect to it every single day when, that I come here. And we're hoping it's enough of a Wi-Fi connection to do this download. If not, Jacob just said that the Starbucks parking lot has good Wi-Fi as well. So yes. if this doesn't work, then we'll try another one. Okay, so that didn't work. So we're gonna try Starbucks. So it turns out trying two different grocery stores, REI, the Simple. actual Verizon. Uh, what else did we try? Um, two McDonald's. Two McDonald's. KFC. Um, Starbucks. Starbucks. Um, my phone hotspot, <laughs> which we could have done from the driveway. No, because we have crappy connection even on our cell phones. Yeah, phone, I guess so. that's true. So my my phone hotspot is actually working, but I have 10% battery. But luckily, you can't even see it down there. Is there any other interior no. lights? Nine. No. Your car's not fancy enough for interior lights? It, I could rig up a whole little LED thing with the whole around here, but no, we don't need lights in a Tesla. <sighs> Gosh, you're becoming such a little dude. I, I, you're the one complaining about being able to see your cell phone. <laughs> well, it's down here on the little uh, docking where you can charge it. With It's a wireless docking down here on the little console. So it's charging and we're getting, oh, there's information on there you can't see, so. Okay, I'm just gonna share this because I don't necessarily need to be right. 
I just, <laughs> I just am. I he has been circling. We finally got the my. Um, and it dropped down to zero bytes, but the green line's still there. Anyways, it's still to calculate. That's eight. Or anyway, it so, says zero BS. <laughs> Yes. So my hotspot was working, but he didn't want us park over here. Because we, we were in two handicapped parking spaces. You're making a lot of noise in between the talking, honey. We were in two handicapped parking spaces, and I didn't want to take up the handicapped parking Then he moves to the other side of the parking lot, and then the connection goes down. No, it didn't go down. Moved it just it. maybe slowed. That is going down, dude. <laughs> <laughs> So he went to another spot and another spot. I'm like, why don't you just go back where you were? And he just did not want it to be me being right. You always think it's about you. Yes, no, I was because just you can to literally park open. right next to I the handicapped I did spot. Not want, I was in between two of them. Two handicapped people would have been upset with me. At eight o'clock at night at McDonald's. I don't you think say it's handicapped big... people don't eat McDonald's. Like, late you can at night. park right next that's, to the that's handicapped discriminatory. spot. He's being that's a discriminatory. Anyway, we came back over I'm here. I'm offended that you think handicapped people would not give McDonald's. He's deflecting. <laughs> You'd be a true politician. Instead of parking where I told him to go yeah. back and park. I to. thought it would be better. Okay, regardless. But it wasn't. Ignore him. Ignore him. Oh. We're right across and now it's like speeding through. It's just going through and uh -huh. he's just having a hard time. It says zero BS again. <laughs> yes, I'm zero BS. You're zero I was BS. correct. That's I'm right, zero that's right. BS. Anyway, it's going fast that's now. Cool. I don't need to be right. I just want to get this done so we don't have to sit in the parking lot waiting for it to have a good connection. Software complete, and I guess we now install that at home, correct? Yeah. And then it'll update overnight? I guess we could just click schedule. 2 a.m. should be fine. Well, you can go home and schedule it now so that you can actually sleep knowing it's gotten done. You can schedule it for 10 p.m. if you wanted to. Okay. Because you know you're going to want to come back out here and look at it again. <laughs> of all the magic places in the world I've been to, this is where my heart is. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you.